Right lads, welcome to the year 1337. So uh, things are looking pretty much like EU4, other than the Byzantines being a bit big, the Ottomans being a bit small, and the Holy Roman Empire being a bit uh, unified. So let's go ahead and... There you go, that's what you're used to. Today we're playing as Granada. Why Granada? Because, well, uh, in EU4 they're ridiculously difficult. Uh, I would say they are definitely one of the hardest starts in the game, and so I thought I'd replicate that in CK3. So we have about 2,000 troops, Castile have 10,000, Portugal have 3,000, Aragon have 5,000, Navarra with 4,000, and Mallorca with 3,000. So definitively the smallest uh, of, of nations over here, and the North Africans are all at war with each other. How am I going to do this? Hadn't thought that far ahead, not gonna lie to you. Okay, our character is Yusuf ibn Soraya. He's stubborn, lustful, and arrogant. Not the best, not the worst. Uh, we don't have any wives, which is actually kind of useful because we can get some allies. Can I swear fealty to you? Interesting. So I could. And that would mean that we could declare war on a couple of guys smaller than us and build up our power to try and take him out from within and we can get religiously protected. That is an option. Could also swear fealty to the Marinids. Again, similar sort of strategy, only they are weaker. I do think that... I think this is a good idea. I think we have to swear fealty, right? Current diplomacy is our main thing. Okay. Yeah, we swear fealty and then just go from there. Okay. We're going to try and damage them from the inside. So we're going to re-reconquista from the inside. As we swealty fed, as I'm apparently saying. As fealty sworn. Okay. Right, so let's start fabricating a claim over here. Make a decent amount of money. I reckon we take the prestige hit and just go for like a genius wife. Uh, she's okay. We wouldn't actually lose any prestige. All right, let's marry a dwarf. Uh, and that's about it for now. You've called me the Marshal of Castile. Okay, it's an interesting choice, Chief, but I'll take it. All right, and he has given away a bunch of territory. So do we want to go after... No, we don't really want to go after this guy just yet. We want to go after this guy. I've got 200 troops. And our wife's already pregnant. Nice. I think this is the right play. I think people are going to be upset with it. Oh, well, my kid's still born. Uh, I think... Oh, fuck on the dwarf. Please don't give birth to the dwarf. I do want to make clear that I'm saying this, you know, in the, in the game, lads. It's not, like, an actual opinion of mine. Okay. So, apparently, we can't declare wars. War, sanction... Oh no, I can't change my level. This is bad. Okay, we need to get a, we need to get a hook on our, on our leash so that we can declare war and have sanction declare war. What if I okay, I can get rid of my protected religious rights in favor of sanctioned war declarations. I do want to stay Muslim. That's so that is a rule that I want because I'm like okay. Here's the aim of the campaign. I'm gonna try and reconquista this area, re reconquista this area, um, having already been conquered myself. <laughs> do you think that I could get a hook on you? No, because we don't have any abilities like that. Okay, well, he's in He's in there. So let's get our spy master. Find secrets in Toledo, please. Are you really the best we've got? No, my mother is. It's a horrible thing to say about my mother, but she can she can find some secrets. Okay, in the meantime, we need to be able to expand. So we are going to give up our religious rights in return for the ability to declare wars. Definitely a good idea because no one can declare war on us. All right, instantly we get ourselves a quick victory there. Right, Duke of Mercia is more powerful than we are. We want to kind of go after Cordoba. Ooh, you have allies. You do not. No, no, no. We need to find some secrets. Fabricate them if you have to. Your son? You're giving me your son. Sure, okay. Dude, this king's placing a lot of faith in me. That is a very much unfounded. All right, who do I have a claim on? You. Let's do it. Only two of them survive. I've got a decline. He's not going to prison me, is he? He might do, to be fair. He has the ability to imprison me now. Uh, let me try swaying him. I'm going to go for Befriend. And we'll start... Oh, no. <laughs> uh, yeah, he has, he has a legit legitimate reason to be able to uh, murder us. So let's hope that he doesn't use that. Otherwise, we're kind of dead. Sure, he keeps on giving me his children. Okay, this one's a bit more even. Looks like we won against... Oh, okay. Portugal will have beaten the Mariners. They've already started to expand into North Africa. I'm going to hope we catch someone here. We do indeed. Wonderful, because I could not win that war. Right. Am I able to create this title? I can. Excellent. I'm now a double duke. Let's grant this to this guy. Okay, so far so good. We aren't altogether that strong, but that's okay. I do want to start expanding to Muslim territory to make sure that it stays Muslim. Okay, for some reason our wife has lost some ability. I think it's because she's pregnant. Oh, okay, cheers. 
It just gave me a vassal. Oh, right, that's, that, that's of course. When I grab land, in fact, I don't want this land. I need, to grow, I need to expand into areas with duchies that I can have. Because if I expand into half of them, right, and then let's say there are five provinces. If I take three of them, I can form the duchy. At which point, these other two remaining vassals become my de jure vassals, and he'll give them to me. Like over here in Mercia, for example. One, two, three. I think two of them will give me the third for free. Unfortunately, he's kind of big. Mainly because of this region. So, what's the play? Kind of surrounded. I've got to go after this guy, this Mercy guy. I've got to break his hold. Well, let's take Kadia anyway. Sure. Oh, Burgos. Where, where are you? Up there. It's another thousand troops. So I don't see why I wouldn't. All right, another 600. Let's murder you. You suddenly got another thousand. I think our troops are better. There we go. Another province. Let's give it to my son. Ah, oh, my son's a dwarf. That's it, kid. I'll educate you either way. This guy's got minus 100. He's going to challenge me to chess. I'm not going to do that. He's got 5,000 troops now, but he doesn't have any allies. I do. Let's go after him. Can propose one alliance without marriage. It's just him. He's the most powerful vassal. Okay, Alfonso has declared war on us. Uh, this is what we feared. There's 11,000 troops. We have around 6,000 with our allies. We get some mercenaries for three years. Can we get anyone with a decent commander? Okay, we'll get some more some mercenaries. That's 4,000. Okay, where is our ally? I don't know where he is. Okay, he's over here. I just gotta marry anyone I can. It'll get me like, a couple of it's like seven hundred troops. That'll that'll do me. I don't know where you are. Ah, oh, brilliant. <laughs> have a dud of an alliance, isn't it? Okay, realistically, I have to rush for this for his capital, right? Okay, he's just murdered all my troops, and he's killed my entire allied troop base as well. Okay, rush for his capital. Come on, please. Not the time for chess, chief. Oh my god, we have taken him hostage. I don't believe it. Well, I guess someone's getting deposed today. Can seize the title of vacation. Oh, this is glorious. <laughs> well, well, well. If he isn't just a little peasant with a stupid hat, the Avenger, my ass. All right, now we've got this 12-year-old kid involved. Excellent, and we can go back to conquering. That could have gone very poorly indeed. That almost did. I think we were a day away. I had to slow down to speed three there. Right, where was I? I wanted to fight you. I have a claim. If I call my allies in, I have the numbers. Chancellor Castile. Yeah, appreciate that, mate. After I, I basically got you the uh, the throne. No biggie. No need to thank me. Can I, I think I can declare war for more than one claim. So let's just get a bunch of claims. Go after him. Arrogant is horrible. Get something else other than arrogant. Compassionate might be better than arrogant. Ah, oh, fine. Keep arrogant. I really hate arrogant. Why is she your guardian? Offer guardianship. Why can't I make it m me? Okay, apparently I can't. Okay, maybe because I have too many. All right, yeah, I've got too many. Right, let's remove all of my guardians. There we go. My son, the irrational gambler, is a dwarf. Okay, buddy. Uh, offer guardianship me. That's what I wanted to do. I think my mother died. Start. To yeah, let's start exchanging letters with Alfonso. Uh, what do you like? Administration. He has zero. Oh, let's try just engaging with him. I do not learn much from his letters. Oh, well, we tried. All of Mercia. That's the claim we want. My God. 700, no. My son, right? Okay, so I got a claim on all of Mercia. Unfortunately, uh, <laughs> the King of Castile now controls it. So that sucks. God's sake. <laughs> that happened literally instantly as I was about to declare war. Let's check if there are any factions. Liberty. Let's see if anyone wants to join an independence faction. What the hell's... Oh, not this again. But now he's just way more powerful. Ah, uh, <laughs> oh, for God's sake. To all of Toledo, why not? We're now in debt. Let's go House of Warriors. I mean, I don't understand why he doesn't get attrition when he's running around my lands. He's going to keep running around. The issue is he's taking some of my lands, but I'm just waiting for him to lose supply. And now we go for his capital. Okay, he's starting to suffer mass attrition. That was the plan. So we keep baiting him around. Ooh. Okay, murdering him has not worked. I think we won something. Not sure what. All right, boys, we've got to pray for round two here. Come on. <laughs> and Granada, the kingmaker, removes another king of Castile. Oh, my God. Right. Who's the next one that's going to get me to revoke my titles then, eh? My God. Oh, it's this guy. It's the Avenger. He's actually in Sevilla. All right. Now... I need these religious rights, man. You're intimidated by my dreadful reputation. Honestly, I can kind of see why. 
Right, can we actually start declaring war on people around me now? I have a claim on Mercy, I can go for that. Look at this guy. Ah! <laughs> what? <laughs> Why? Oh my god. Not the time for chess, mate. Right, there's 100% on them. At least, I'm, at least I'm gaining land whilst I'm deposing this stupid guy. I reckon we run the same strat. I mean, it's worked two times before. All right, run around the mountains a bunch. To be fair, this time we might be able to beat them in open battle. Okay, our friends are dead. You know the drill, boys? Surely at this point we know we're like a back way in. Okay, so instead of enforcing demands, which I think is a stupid idea, I'm going to white peace because it gives us a truce for five years. We're going to do that. Please accept. Okay, he accepted just as he was going to kill me. Wonderful. Okay. This man has 10,000 troops under his belt. Okay. So now we have a few years before, you know, he comes back and murders us again. So we have to get strong before then. All right, we're going to try and find cheese vikings. That's that's going to hold the secret. Sorry, what? You want my son to be your, your thing? No. <laughs> he has a truce with me. How? How can he declare war when he has a truce? <laughs> well, boys. <laughs> I think more people are joining me each time now. I reckon we have to get some mercenaries. Um, well, maybe not. Oh, he's smart this time. He's leading his army. So I'm not going to be able to capture him. We do have more troops, though. So, I mean, let's go fight him. Like I said, I think I'm making the realm more unstable. There we go. Okay. Let's keep chasing him. He's retreated into my lands. Not sure how that's allowed get more claims for like the the brief year period of peace that we get this might be the weirdest game of ck3 i've ever played there we go so now do i just depose him sure why not we all know we'll be back soon anyway in the meantime let's deck on this guy who's this next guy in charge it's a child yes there we go a feeble child there we go you can take that tello and you case can take that I think I have a claim win by the cause. I do. Declare war. Raise armies. Straight in. Peace you out. Oh, there's this province as well. No, uh, I think that's just ours anyway. Um, Alright, we finish up this war. And that gives us our province. Everyone wants the kingdom of Castile. I think I've just created the most unstable kingdom. King Edward III has attacked him. For the Duchy of Navarra. Sounds good to me. Oh, well, nachos. I'm going to give to one of my sons. Can I really not give it to my son? Give it to this guy. There you go. I can negotiate alliances. My player. Okay. Sure. This guy. He hates me. But he'll accept an alliance. Sure. Right, you. My son. Sure. Okay. Because steals a war with England. Look how many alliances this guy's got. That's filth, that. Right. We need two more from the from this county of Badajoz. This is horrible. This is such a weird game. All right, can I marry anyone more powerful now? The English come in with 20,000 men. The plan is this. Stop challenging me to chess, man. The second I can. Why can't I ally you? I can. You, no, I can't. I have too many existing alliances. Okay. Cheers, mate. Convert to orthodoxy. No. Please, I didn't fight all these wars just to stay. Just, just convert to orthodoxy, man. Okay, so we lost the war. This could be big. This could be so big. This could be huge. This could be everything I've ever needed. Two duchies and all the counties. We've got to do it. And we have to do it. Uh, let's get some mercenaries. We've got like 400. What can I get for 400? Like two bands. Okay, he's a small child, so he'll be like in his castle, surely. Go, 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 go. Bear in mind, he's only, his troops are only going to get more. Uh, he's only going to get more troops. More numerous. Where are you going, buddy? Yes. Okay. That's huge. Straight for his capital. Meanwhile, do you mind uh, actually getting me control of my lands? Okay, apparently there's a new king. It's fine. We'll fight him as well. He has fewer troops. Nice. I think more allies, though. I think... Are you at war with each other, yeah? So I don't need to worry about you. Okay, nice. Pretty sure my wife died. That's okay. I'm gonna get irritable. Guy deserves it after fighting so... Like, he's seen, what, four kings now? Five? <gasps> yes! Okay, right. This has been turned around dramatically. All right, let's give away all of these things. Okay, that's a temple holding. Let's give it to a noble. I think that's another, that's a castle holding. Is it any good? I don't know. So I'm just going to give it away to Reis. You look pretty good. So I'm going to give away like one of these, maybe. Like Carmona. Let's give away Carmona. My cousin. There you go. And let's give this to Shabtun. That is huge though. 
We took so much. Oh my god. How did I get this? I don't care. You know what? I don't care. Dude, England coming in clutch. Quick shout out to my boy Edward the Fourth. Saving our asses there. And of course the mercenary companies. Okay, we gain more stress. And our kid's gonna die. Talk to Confidant. Okay. That was pretty big. Is your kingdom of Andalusia? We can, we can become king of Andalusia. If we have the money for it. Which we don't. But if we become independent, we can create the kingdom of Andalusia. Become part of the kingdom of Castile in approximately 73 years. Yeah, not today. Not while we're still kicking. Oh no, they convert a load of areas to Catholic and what? Rabbinism? The Jewish, okay, it's cool. The Jews have uh, settled in our territory. That's fine, we're a multicultural area. Boys, I really don't think it's a good idea for you. I think that this is not gonna go well for you. Let's do it. Let's, let, let's run the gauntlet. Here we go. Grab ourselves some mercs. Right, that will do that. And immediately one of them escaped the dungeon. They use a prison today. Uh, okay. Guess let's go again. You have 3,500 troops. I have 5,000 troops. Are you sure about this? Yeah, this was a terrible idea. My truce with King Pedro ends. We're in the middle of a war. And we're going to lay with our wife. Ah, and now we're lovers. <laughs> and we have captured the king. Enforce demands. He's deposed. It's like Castilian king number six or something stupid. All right, let's head over here and start getting claims on everyone else. Got a small girl in charge. They've got 2,000 troops. I battered this kingdom up and down the Iberian Peninsula. Jesus Christ. No lie, I was super tempted to convert faith as well. I'm very much glad I didn't. Everyone's escaping the prisons. All right. Uh, revoke title. I'm just going to keep it. <laughs> What's anyone going to do? Oh, uh, apparently got upset at me. Is anyone else better at stewardship? She upset at me now that she's my primary spouse. Okay, you have four in stewardship. You have four... You have 10. You have 18. What? My wife. No. I want this new one. Duchess Teller. What? Where? Okay. Hang on a second. Where's the new one? Yeah. TM. Management. There we go. All right. Let's fix it. We make a lot of money. I'm just saving it all for like times that I think we'll need it. I'm sure to be building stuff. <gasps> oh no. He said I have a small penis. <laughs> Kill him for it. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. That's insecurity right there. And create a head of faith. All right, I'm going to click recreate <laughs> that. So now we have, we're the current head of faith. This man's a bit of a legend. The time we've been forced to endure without a spiritual leader has been trying. A lot, long last ordeal is over, however, I've convinced the clergy to accept me as the one true caliph. With the faithful finally united behind me, I will lead more laodism into a, into a new age. And we're going to get obsessed with vengeance. What does that do? We've got Jizia, struggling submission, and adaptive. Okay. Okay, King Pedro is attacking for the Portuguese claim on the kingdom of Castile. Oh no, <laughs> we're gonna get another king. Oh, for God's sake. All right, well, let's keep getting strong. All right, let's get some new uh, men of Let's get some bombards going, uh, some crossbowmen, and also some pikemen. I swear to God, Portugal, you test me, I'll crush you. My wife has found out someone's trying to kill me. Standard. Oh, wait, I'm gonna lose that? Who are you? I am going to lose that. Oh, great. My other son's dead now. Oh, Jesus Christ. Truly is a cur like the most miserable timeline. Why would you beat me? Higher quality, more men at arms counter. Where is this? It's in planes. Okay, let's get some planes, guys, then. Who works well in planes? Cavaleros. Let's get them. I'm also going to get some mercenaries. I don't care. Someone else has died as well. There we go. Okay, I've got I'm over my holding size. I'll sort that in a sec. Just let me just finish this lot off first. Okay. Enforce demands. All right, Walid, you can take that. Halal, you can take that. Who is my heir? My, my son. Okay, he's a bold altruist. He looks pretty good. God, how many kids do I have? Seven. Well, two, three, three have died. Four have died. You were drowned. You died in mysterious circumstances and you were slain in battle. Kids keep on dying, man. Okay, so. Alakos can go to this court imam, dude. Arrogant. Yeah, become arrogant, mate. I mean, this man might kill over and die if he does anything to go against his uh, personality. At this point, I might just start a war to just get out of here. All right, Bethachos, create that. Sevilla, we need one more county. We have one, two. Okay, we need a third here. Salamanca's up next. Oh my God. Little by little, we will make this happen. You know what? Who are you? Dutch of Cantabria. Okay. Uh... Apparently that was a mistake. Can I just keep throwing myself at him? See, it says higher quality. What do you contain? 
770 crossbowmen, some armored footmen, and some horsemen. What do I contain? I don't have armored footmen, but like, I should have other stuff. Fine, let's get rid of pikemen. And let's create armored footmen. Let's get 200 of them. Why am I even here? Why am I, why am I, why do I care so much? I shouldn't, so I don't. What just happened? Oh. Sure. Don't have to fight you, huh? Yeah. He just stole my land! Dude, come on! <sighs> and so the cycle begins anew. Okay, we can't let all these little stacks die. There we go. I can't, I can't believe this keeps happening. Who is the next in line? This dude. <laughs> the Normans have turned up. And also a Holy Roman Empire has taken out the front. Uh, tell you now, the strat's goaded. There we go. I've deposed him. So now we can go after some of our former territories. Which for some reason were just given to the Portuguese. I didn't have a say in that. Don't you dare do it again. Like, I swear. My guy looks ancient now. What other lands that I have? Yeah, I had your lands. I'm infirm. A couple more wins, boys. They just disappeared? I didn't have a chance to click no. So I'm just going to claim that as a win. It disappeared before I could click anything. We did, I think he just took... No, he didn't take it. I don't get it. I don't understand what that was then. Why it just disappeared suddenly. I'll take it. I'm not complaining. Not this again. All right. There we go. Well, I've already got my troops up, I suppose. Okay, I did something ridiculously huge brain. Um, unfortunately, I paused the recording because I was running out of space and I wanted to skip ahead a little bit. Uh, so now we're here. Here's what I did. Uh, as you can see, Portugal has, has diminished rather a lot in size, uh, just in terms of their holdings, because of Toledo. Uh, this guy used to be my vassal, so I declared war on Portugal like the Queen, with everyone's help with a bunch of mercenaries, uh, and took uh, Toledo from her, because I also have a claim on Toledo, but I couldn't declare war on her for some reason, so I could just declare war for the entire Duchy of Toledo against a weaker guy. It's, it's honestly, it was, it's my genius, it's, it's terrifying. Wife is dead. Everyone around me is dead. I'm about to die. I'm infirm. I'm honestly shocked to survive this. Oh, for God's sake. I don't understand how we keep on doing this dance. Okay, so we've died, which means that we no longer have that war of, with, in terms of Portugal. So that's great. Also giving me vassals. That's also nice. Wait, am I Catholic? Am I a woman? No, I'm, I'm a dude, I think. Yeah. Okay. Caliphate of Cordoba. Okay. Uh, I have to give away some of this land. How good is this? This kind of sucks. Uh, let's get some secondary spouses that are good at stewardship. Uh, and also some to give me some alliances. Because doubtless I'm going to need it when this woman declares war on me. Alright, let's have a look at this guy. He's uh, zealous, compassionate, and arrogant. Pretty decent. Flagellant, aggressive attack, and an adequate bargainer. Kind of okay stats. Uh, let's get this woman as our primary spouse. Okay, now we only have to give away two things. That's wonderful. So Mercia... We'll give away to this guy, and that's apparently it. Excellent. <sighs> Almost lost that. I think a master play from our father. <laughs> we grew a beard. <laughs> okay, nice. A master play from our father there. He knew that, that we couldn't win a war against the uh, the Portuguese, because you got 12,000 men, uh, whilst embroiled in this war at least. Uh, so he decided as a final play to kill himself so that we didn't have to deal with that. And I've realized my speech completely irrelevant because now I have to deal with that. All right, our allies turned up. We probably need another alliance. Uh, yeah, 2,900. Excellent. And now I can call you in. No, I can't call vassals in as allies in war. Okay, so that was a complete mistake. 100%. Okay, wonderful. So he's got 10,000 troops. We have about 10,000. Difference is we also have 1,000 ducats. That we can use the Catalan band going. We'll get this guy going as well. That should even up the playing field a little bit. Diplomacy, just like our father, huh? I just wanted a martial guy for one. No, you know what? You're going stewardship, mate. What? Will you join me in declaring our friendship? My friend? I, I get a best friend. He's a lowborn guy. Yeah, he's my best friend. I've got a best friend, lads. Let's go find him here. Thank you. And take back some of our lands. Damn, that's a lot of troops up there. Oh, he's going for the strat. He's going for the strat. Oh, she's leading an army. Smart woman. Oh, we've got 100%. We kidnapped someone. Okay. So what's this? Duke for war... For, and Duke Enrique's claim for steel. Yeah, sure, dude. I don't I don't care. Take the steel. I already deposed one kid. I'm compassionate, so it's going to... Oh, God. Everyone's going to give me critical stress. Wonderful. All right, we're going to wound ourselves. It's a horrible way of dealing with, uh, with issues, but there we go. <laughs> we have most of the kingdom of Castile under our control. Oh. <sighs> Pretty standard, isn't it? Wait, isn't that, isn't that my ally? 
What's wrong with your face? You got some sort of grayscale going on. It looks like it's about to happen, and it did. You, I mean, he had 100%, so I don't know what happened there. Huh. Meanwhile, we could just start conquer the Duchy of Navarra. Um, I don't see why we wouldn't do that. We've got twins. Could have sworn we had bombards. Yeah. They don't really help that much, mainly because I don't have enough. Them. For the love of God, man. Dude, I need an intrigue character. If I had an intrigue character, I could get a hook and then just, we, it, we could have done that one thing that like uh, prevents them, like, you know, keep religious pr pr protection or like title revocation, right? Because I'm Muslim, which means they're allowed to imprison me. And so they ask, because I'm like evil to them, they ask me to, to, to give over a title, which I'm not going to do every time. So I like all the disgruntled vassals are. Oh, I've captured something, I think. Or I just have 100%. Wonderful. Okay. I'm Luna. It's Abdelaziz, Najera is going to go to Musa, and Tudela is going to do or to go to Mayor Catan of La Serena. Okay, let's go murder the, murder. Let's go murder the Portuguese. I've right, got to make sure we actually get this stuff back. Because otherwise, he'll have ticking wars against me. What? Um, Maria Knights. Jesus. Aiming to have the county's new leader and host a banquet where we'll have all the local religious leaders slaughtered like cattle. Why would I do that? A total monster. Jesus. Seems a little harsh. Too many counties. Your realm size is too large for a duke. Okay, sure. Well, we'll get, we'll we'll change that in a bit, mate. Don't worry. I'm not gonna lie. I preferred it when uh, it was Toledo because I could sort of march into Toledo pretty easily. And nowadays, I can't do that. I'm just gonna keep attacking him at this point. 93%. I think the max is 100% on this. I've ha I have got the max. Defender controls war targets. What does he hold of mine? I'm the defender. Defender controls war target. What the war? What is the war target? Tell me what the war target is. I swear it's just to hold off. Like, do I have to take his capital? I'm the defender. Surely he has to take my capital. Oh, screw it. I'm just going to take the casualties. I think I have to take Lisboa. No, but whatever. <laughs> we won either way. Okay, so that splits up Portugal a little bit. And I'm going to declare war on you for independence. Because I need to now become not under you. All right, we're going to win one or two battles. Well, just one battle. I'm just going to blitz Lisboa, man. We'll take like 600 casualties. Okay, we're going to kill some people, apparently. That's okay. This should... Yep, that's 100%. All right. So now, I believe, I should be able to form the kingdom of Andalusia. Al-Andalus. There you go. Excellent. And now we have a royal court. A told court. I'm arrogant and compassionate, so... I get critical stress out, stress out of the way. Wonderful. And we wound ourselves. Oh, Navarra's dead. The whole empire is collapsing. Yeah, we don't want that. We'll have a dagger and put on our father's aged cheese. We found a holy order. Let's do that. The thing is, this dude's uh, Muslim, but his, <laughs> his boys are still Jewish. At right, this time, instead of declaring a uh, jihad, how about we just holy war? Actually, let's just conquer the duchy. Like, we have the prestige for it. Okay, he has a lot more troops than I do, so we're going to call in our boy. That's the main reason I invited him to our family in the first place. Right, we're going in. Okay, excellent. Fortunately, this guy's capital is right next to ours. Uh oh, uh oh, I think I lost that. Okay, we just about won. Well, we didn't, our, our friends did. And we lost quite a few troops. I don't know what that was. It just flashed up for a sec, and it keeps on flashing up for a second. I was really hoping to capture him there. Wish you could assault. I think you can, maybe? I'm not sure. Assault fort, there you go, look at that. I never clicked that button before in my life. It's gonna become irritable. It's just the way of these things. Let's repair the aged cheese. I don't know how it's going to break over time, but apparently we need to repair the aged cheese. All right, let's go fight down here. All right, took a little while, but there we go. That's that done. Valencia is going to go to our son. Oh, my best friend died. Meanwhile, France is in turmoil. Um, I reckon let's just nip in and take out Portugal. Oh, very small duchies. We need more. Eat my cheese. Eat my ra aging cheese. What? God, we've been waiting a long time to eat that. Let's, let's eat the cheese. Just ate some cheese. Okay. We're going to Hajj. Okay, cut the part where I said we're going to Hajj. Stop the Crusaders. I found a university. Why not? I'm going to go on a pilgrimage. I'm just grinding out that uh, piety to try and get enough to become a paragon of virtue. All right, we're going to Medina. Cost us a thousand ducats. God damn. Uh, let's go ahead and ransom everyone, I reckon. Oh, oh, there we go. Actually, we're home and we're ready to go. Portugal, declare war. Holy War for Kingdom, Kingdom of Portugal. 
We're going to call in our boys. And let's blitzkrieg them. Concerned other rulers might get involved. But we just beat up the Aragonese. The French should be... Well, they were embroiled in the Civil War. Now they're not anymore. So uh, it's actually quite a few troops. I think we'd win this? Yep, we do. Wonderful. Now, is it a woman in charge? No, but he's a sickly man. I'm just going to rush the capital. There's 100%. Did we capture him? We did indeed. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is that Al-Andalus is a thing. We are the dominant power in Iberia. The year is 1404, 40 years before the start of EU4. Let's have a look at the rest of the world. It looks to me like things are pretty stable apart from the... F well, Muscovy's a thing. That's interesting. The Golden Horde has collapsed a bit. Uh, and it looks like uh, Austria-Hungary has really taken a turn for the better. So yeah, I would call that a, dr a dramatic success thanks to this man of, of course, Caliph Yusuf. Oh, he's uh, the most big brain man. His stats don't reflect who he was as a person. Uh, but he had to depose so many. That was easily the weirdest um, CK3 campaign I've ever, ever had to play. But it was actually pretty fun, so I enjoyed that. So, lads, if you want to see more CK3 content, I'm now sort of pursuing, like, a CK3, EU4, Victoria 3, and sometimes Hoi 4 content on the channel. I'm really enjoying, like, lots of variety. I hope that you, uh, that you guys are as well. Please let me know how you feel about all that in the comments down below. What kind of videos you want to see from me. Uh, it's always good to do a little bit of a census. So, yeah, that'd be great to help me out. Please do make sure to like and subscribe if you want to help me out further. Otherwise, boys, I will see you all next time. Goodbye. Huge shout out to our patrons, most notably Charlie Demorel, Krilly, Flyerton, JDow52, Cargon, Xiaomi, Lewis Wright, Nicole's Christ, QA Shard, Redguard, and Shadow Singer. Your support means a lot, guys. Whilst you're here, you might as well click on another video. I mean, it's, it's literally right there.